What's going on Halo fans, Luke the Notable here, and today I'm going to be showing you which is the playlist that has the best recs per hour. How many recs are you going to get per hour? What is the best playlist to play that so you can get the best rec cards in the game quickly? So what I did is I played 10 games of each playlist, each of the four playlists, Arena, Warzone, Warzone Assault, and Big Team Battle. Then I took the amount of recs I got per game, averaged it across the 10, and then times it by how the time per game that I got in the averages, and then I got how many recs I would get per hour based on the recs I got per game and how long the games took. So first off, and I know that may sound a little confusing because I went through it fast, but I'm gonna show you this and I'm gonna put it on screen and make it look pretty simple. So for Arena, I got about 800 recs per game. Each game took about seven minutes or 8.5 games per hour and times 800 by 8.5, you get about 6,800 6, recs per hour. For Warzone, I got about 800 recs per, or not 800, 1,800 recs per game. Uh, the games took on average about 19 minutes, which means you get 3.15 games per hour. And then if you take 3.15 times 1,800, you get just a little under 6,000. So for Warzone Assault, I got around 1,300 rec points per game. I, each game took about 9 minutes and 30 seconds, or about 6.5 or 6.3 uh, games per hour. And then if you multiply 6.3 times 1,300, you get a little over 8,000 rec points per hour. And for Big Team Battle, I got about 1,100 rec points per game. It took about 11 minutes to finish each game, and that's about 5.5 games per hour. You multiply 1,100 times 5.45, and you get a little under 6,000. The data shows that everything is pretty much the same, except Warzone Assault, which tends to give about 2,000 more recs per hour. This is something that was kind of the consensus online, but now I've actually proven it. Warzone Assault is the best method to get the maximum rec points per hour. But what else is interesting about this is every other playlist has just about the same amount of rec points per hour. You should expect about 6,000 rec points per hour playing any other playlist besides Warzone Assault. So if you're playing a playlist right now that isn't Warzone Assault, based on the fact that you think you're getting more rec points per hour than anybody else, you're wrong. The only, basically the only playlist you're going to be able to play to get more rec points per hour is Warzone Assault. Everything else is baseline. So if you don't want to play Warzone Assault, if you don't care about rec points per hour, just play whatever playlist make you happy. Thank you guys for watching. I hope this helps some of you that are trying to get high level recs in Warzone. If you have any questions, please go down to the comment section. I reply to every single comment that gets posted to my channel so you know I'm going to reply to you. If you haven't checked out my other 30 plus Halo 5 tips videos, go check them out now. You'll probably find something that can teach you something. Send me a friend request on Xbox Live at Luke the Notable, and I'll see you online, guys. Bye-bye.